Welcome to Comcast High School Sports On Demand, powered by MaxPreps.com. I'm Cynthia Nickerson. This is a very proud moment for Jermica Lee. The Klein Oak senior came in third place in the 300 meter hurdles in a district meet. This is a great accomplishment for her. You know, we're in one of the toughest districts and toughest areas in the state. We've got uh, some of the toughest competition probably in the nation. And for Jamika to finish third is, is a huge accomplishment. She should, she should be able to do some good things uh, at the next level at the regional meet at Baylor. Jermika seemed to be destined for track. She started running at an early age, a very early age. I would put her down. She started standing up on her own when she was like five months. And when I put her down, she would just take off. She would take off, so she ran. She ran even when I take her to the doctor's office. She just would run over there to her dad or whatever. You know, she would just run. She wouldn't walk. Yeah, and then she started walking later, but she would run first. My mom, when I was young, at seven months, I was jogging like I wasn't crawling like everybody else. I started running as a little girl and so like when I got older everybody always said I was fast. I used to race against cousins like usual like everybody do. Then when I got in seventh grade that's when I started running. I never ran before seventh grade though. Before when I got in seventh grade and I was beating the eighth graders I was like hey I'm faster than them. She tried other sports, but her natural running talent convinced her to stick with track. She sleep and eat and everything else involves track. Jermika enjoys the 4x4 and hurdles. Well, actually in middle school, when Coach X, we was able to skip a day out of workout if we was going to go train with the hurdlers to learn the hurdles. And I thought it was a field event, so I thought I would be doing like a whole lot of events until I found out it was the actual running event. She's done well in pole vaulting, 100 and 300 meter hurdles. I like the hurdles um, better, but the 100 hurdles is my favorite because it's shorter and I would have a shorter workout if I was just to do those. But the three, I don't have the, te the, the techniques just down as right for the 100 hurdles, but my speed is very fast. That's why the 300 hurdles is better because I don't need as much techniques, but I still do the best. Jermika made a name for herself on the track team at Nimitz High School for three years. Then her family moved and she enrolled at Klein Oak at the start of her senior year. It was, it was pretty hard because she, she, she did ask to stay. And um, she was kind of afraid that she wasn't going to be able to get what she really needed in, um, uh, in order to, to try to get a scholarship and stuff for, for college and that she was losing scouts or whatever. Um, but I just, the, my faith, our faith in God, and I just moved and, I mean, hey, he's going to handle it from there, right? And it appears Jermika had nothing to worry about. Oh, they were very nice. Everybody heard about me because the coach was bragging about me before the, the season started. So it's like a lot of people already knew about me and they was waiting for the actual track meet to see how I really was. Uh, as a teammate, jamika has been exactly what we needed. She's, she moved in this year as a senior, and she, was, she immediately took a leadership role. As soon as we get to a track meet, she's the one in charge of getting the girls to warm up. Um, she takes initiative to get her warm-ups going herself. Uh, so, and she's, so she's been a great leader all around this whole season. She seems to be a natural athlete. She's got, she's got the physique for it, the perfect physique for it, and she's got the strength to push through. She seems to have the mental toughness to push herself throughout hard workouts. Whenever we have her do those 400 hurdle work, 400 meter hurdle workouts, uh, she's got the mental toughness to push herself through and to make herself stronger because she's got goals and she knows that it takes works to achieve those. One of those goals is to beat the Klein Oak record for the 300 meter hurdles. Seconds matter. And she says that's something non-track fans don't seem to get. And other people that don't know track be like, it's just one more second. You're not understanding this, that second it means it's a lot. Jermika has siblings looking to follow in her footsteps. They come out on breaks when I go out to work out. They come with me and I give them a workout. I always told her, I said, you got to set the bar. I said, you're the oldest. You, she have a brother that's older than her, but she, you know, as far as the girls, because she's the oldest girl. And I told her, I said, you have to set the bar, you know, high. I say, because they following, they looking at you. And track fans around the Houston area are looking at Jermika, cheering her on for upcoming regionals, hoping she'll bring home a medal. Jermika has several college offers, but she hasn't decided which school yet. But wherever she goes, that program will be getting someone special. 
uh, they'd be getting an athlete. They'd be getting a hard worker. They'd be getting a dedicated student, a dedicated athlete, um, a, a great team leader, uh, and an all-around uh, amazing kid. I'm Cynthia Nickerson. Thanks for watching Comcast High School Sports on Demand, powered by MaxPreps.com.